Hello, I'm Anne Houghton. This video is to tell you about the process of a clinical negligence claim. If you decided that things might have gone wrong in the care you received, you will want to speak with a specialist solicitor. They'll start by gathering in evidence, most importantly your medical records. You might have obtained those yourself, and there's a video on here about how to do that, or you might want to ask the solicitor to take that step for you. The solicitor will analyse your records, try and identify exactly what happened and where things might have gone wrong. They'll probably instruct an independent medical expert to look at the records as well, somebody in the same discipline as the doctors or nurses who treated you. And that expert will try and explain whether there was negligence in the care you received. Your solicitor might want to take a witness statement from you or from those involved in the care you received and the family around you. Ultimately, the solicitor is working to build evidence to show that there was negligence and secure an admission of liability from the defendant, the defendant being the doctor, hospital, organisation involved in your care. The defendant will be represented by solicitors. You will not have to have direct contact with them and it shouldn't affect the care you continue to receive in any way. Hopefully it will be possible to secure an admission of liability and an out-of-court settlement, so getting the right amount of compensation for you without having to go to court. But sometimes it's necessary to issue court proceedings and the solicitor takes that paper-based step for you. Then the claim goes down a court timetable which ultimately culminates in trial at which a judge makes a final decision